Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I did some Christmas shopping recently and ended up at a mall in, uh, in Milford. Um, that's Milford, Connecticut. And look at the Santa. And this Santa and this mall was so nice. The way they had it decorated was so pretty. I love the reds, traditional reds. And there were children down there waving at Santa. It's so pretty. It really reminds me of um, being a child and going to the mall and seeing Santa. Well, at that time, there really wasn't, there weren't any malls when I was that age. It was pretty much like going downtown, going to this big department store and, and seeing Santa. So really nice. But meanwhile, I'm looking for just some Christmas stuff. And we ended up, uh, this mall still has a Sears that was in the process of clo closing. If, you, if you've you um, read the news over the last, gosh, I guess it's been a year now, Sears has been closing stores. And this particular Sears is closing as well. But they had some pretty things on sale. Um, pillows with... Uh, the farmhouse red trucks, uh, red pickup trucks and barn. Um, nice pillows with a, a big black dog on it. Another pillow with um, a red cardinal. So they had a lot of things on sale there. A lot of their Christmas stuff was on sale. Actually, everything in the store was on sale. But, you know, I was there looking for Christmas decor. Um candles on sale and all ceramic ware is all on sale frames so that's a tip if there's a sears near you you need to beat it down there while they're while they're still opening still open rather and having um still having their sales um they're probably this this store this was a couple weeks ago this store is probably up to 50 percent off now anyway after leaving Sears, uh, ended up going out to one of my favorite stores, Goodwill. So at Goodwill, you will not believe they're all the Christmas stuff they have at Goodwill. Still, um, this is a new, a different Goodwill that I went to. Um, I uh, decided to try one that was not in my neighborhood, uh, just to see if I saw some different stuff. And you would not believe all the blue and white dishes. And ceramic ware that I saw there um, and you will not believe that I actually saw some Ray Dunn a Ray Dunn dish and um, I don't know who gave this dish away but it was originally marked for $5.99 and I think I got it for a dollar because the the it was half off and it was marked for $2, so that's a Ray Dunn dish that was marked at $2 that I got for $1. So I'm really excited about getting that little Ray Dunn piece. I never see Ray Dunn at these stores, so I was really excited about that. So um, I'm checking out, and stay to the end, and I'll show you exactly what I got. But I was so happy about that Ray Dunn piece. Thanks, guys, and this was just a little short haul, but thank you, and I will see you all in my next production. Take care. Okay, guys, so <clears throat> I can't come on camera because I'm in pajamas, but this is what we got. We got this Patron bottle, which I just love the, the way it's, it looks. I don't even drink. It's $2. It's marked $2. But it was green was half off, so I got that for a dollar. Santa from Goodwill or Father Christmas was a dollar. This snow globe, snow globe stocking hanger, the Christmas tree was a dollar. Did I say this urn 
says four dollars, but again, the color was green, so it's two dollars. This little door from Dollar no from Dollar General it was five dollars. This deer I got from Home Goods. I love her. I think she was like $12.99, I can't recall. And of course the Ray Dunn dish. Can't believe I got this from Goodwill. There it was just sitting there. It says two dollars, but the color is green, so got it for one dollar. That nice. And that's it. Thank you guys.